Okay, today we're gonna to be talking about hip openers, but not just your regular hip openers. We're gonna make it dynamic. So how we're gonna do that is, our, so our typical hip opener, we usually go into a bit of hip extension on the back leg. This front leg, we're gonna have the, the lower leg perpendicular to the ground. And now we're moving into a position like this. We might be trying to get the elbow to the ground here. We might be pushing the leg outside or lateral. Um, what I want you to start concentrating on here though, is that this back leg glute is actually going to turn on and now we're going to turn this into kind of a dynamic pump so we want to push ourselves and we can still get in this position but I'm going to turn here to face the camera uh, side on so you can see what I don't want to see is any lumbar flexion occurring so if I'm training kind of a hip internal rotation flexion position here and hip extension here I don't want to train that with excessive lumbar flexion so I really want to limit this movement by glute activation and also if I can keep my lumbar spine neutral. So if I'm trying to get my elbow to the ground and now I'm flexing, maybe I just back off and now I'm using that glute to push me forward. I can still get in here and push. But again, that's a dynamic hip opener and that's gonna help you keep out of that lumbar flexion position and really train a correct sequence. 